University of South Alabama's new president is now officially on the job. Dr. Tony Waldrop plans to take a tour of the campus as part of his first day activities. Local 15's Madupe Adawu is live from USA right now. Is he there yet, Madupe? That's right, Darwin, you know, and it all started here at the Student Recreation Center, but Dr. Tony Waldrop told me that he really wanted to spend his first official day on the job touring the campus, and he really wanted to get a feel for campus life, and he wanted to meet those that really help run the University of South Alabama. Now, Dr. Waldrop picked all the locations. He started at the Student Recreation Center, where he actually shot some hoops. Then he toured the softball field house, where he met the softball team and their coach, and he, his tour ended at the glass blowing studio. Now, Waldrop, I'm told, was a student athlete in college, winning two NCAA championships as a mile runner, and it's kind of why his tour has an athletic theme here. He comes to the university with 30 years of experience in higher education. He was a vice president of the University of Central Florida and vice chancellor of the University of North Carolina and much more. And Dr. Tony Waldrop told me that the late president, Gordon Moulton, laid a solid foundation, and he knows he has big shoes to fill. Anyone coming in, as I am now the one coming in to do that, has it much easier because of what he accomplished when he was here. And so for me, it's a matter of living up to what he created and what he stood for. And Now, I asked President Waldrop his goals for USA, and he tells me he's still learning a lot about the school, so it's a little too premature to answer that question right now. But he says he does want to work on retention rates for, for sure. For now, reporting live at USA, I'm Adupe Edo, Local 15 News. A lot of